Hey everybody and welcome to Tesnet Gaming. We've been lucky enough to get the new Hyblox wall mount VR charging stand from Hyblox they've sent me to check out. So let's check this out baby. Let's open her up. I'll probably do an installation video too when it goes on the wall. It actually hangs on a wall this one does. It actually lights up like my other one did that I won. Look at this. So we've opened the box. What have we got here? Hey, buddy, this is a very fun story. Trust me, you'll love it, I promise. It says, please make your choice. So there's an answer A and an answer B. So let's have a look. What do we got here? Slide. Let's go answer B. Oh, what we got here? Hey, buddy, the answer's on the other side. <laughs> Why don't you try it? And it's showing some of the fan. It's got some of the accessories that they do. Well, okay, what was answer A then? Let's double cheat. Let's cheat a little bit. Satisfy, find us if not, find us, have suggestions, find us. It's a bit of advertising for high blocks, that's what it basically is. I like the way they've done that actually, that looks pretty cool. So they've got the guy with the gun there and the one with the headset on, that's pretty cool. So we've got the instruction manual, we'll just, we'll just take everything out first of all. So that's what it looks like when it's built. Similar sort of design to the uh, desktop charger. So we've got the package here. So we've got the cords, we've got the USBs, we've got the the um, controller holders as well again. So same sort of things, so a few little pluggy looking things in this one, a few little extra bits and pieces. Right, so let's take it out of the box, shall we? Let's take it out of the box like this. Right, what do we got? So we've got that one there, obviously one of the shelves. There's obviously a shelf. That's obviously one of the ones that hold the controllers. That's the other bit that holds the controller. I was going to say that's a bit of cardboard, but uh, that's a stand guide. So we've actually got a guide that actually shows where I can put the holes. So that's pretty cool. That shows me where I can put the holes to hang on the wall. So that gives me an idea of how, how I can put things up. Got the instructions on the back and everything as well. That looks pretty cool. And then the main thing that actually holds them all. So everything clips into these from the sides. A bit like the one on the desktop. Very similar design. We've got the three USB ports and a USB-C as well. For the charging and everything. We've actually got the, the backing plate. That's obviously what hangs on the wall. With the, with the light that lights up, obviously. It's obviously the... Uh... Oh, no, that's actually a level. No, it's got a self-leveler. Oh, look at that. It's actually got its own little self-leveler. So we'll see if it's level. We'll see my floor's level. Probably not. But there's the bubble. It's got a little self-leveler. Look at that. That's pretty cool. And, oh, look at that. We've even got some more batteries. Those ones that charge. That's awesome. That means, like, they double up. That's awesome. They're the ones that have got the split in them. Uh, you can't really see through the bag, but hold on. Let's just open the bag. Right, let's put the bag open. Here we go, right. So yeah, so we've got the batteries again with the thing. So I've got four of them now. Awesome. Fantastic. Fantastic. Oh, and we've got a cleaning cloth as well. Can't go wrong with one of them. And a couple of stickies that go on for like the, the base... So they can stay in the box in ones. Awesome. So we'll come back when it's on the wall and show you it actually installed. So here we have the product here that I've just assembled slightly. So I obviously slid that right hand side in and the left hand side, which hold the controllers. The controllers fit in there. Obviously I've got the wall mount still, which I've which goes on the back and it actually slots and actually slides in, which is really cool. It's going to be really cool on the wall. So uh, when it's on the wall, it's going to look something like this when it's up on the wall. So people, this is the finished product, obviously we're heading up on the wall now. So we've put the three screws in on, on the wall here with the self-leveler. So we're pretty much level, so we're good. The finished product, obviously it's not plugged in yet, but I've got it, just got to plug it in and wire it up and then should be all lit up. Okay, so now we've got both stands. So we've got the Hyblox original desktop stand there lit up and changing colours. As well as the Hyblox wall charger. 
stand RGB LGB it's changing colors as well awesome so what I managed to do I've actually put my uh, PlayStation what was uh, PSVR into that one at the moment I'll just go work out some sort of different way of charging things but that's all right I can work on those I've got that one there for my Quest 2 which looks absolutely fantastic changing the colors so you, as you can see, you've got on the controllers plugged in as well with the blue light. We've got them fitted into the acrylic. It's very stable. Nothing, nothing moving there. I've got the three screws in the wall. All charging. We've got the cord underneath. So you've got the, the, the black one is the one that's going into like the wall. I've got the one charging the Quest. I've got the one charging the controller and one for the other controller. And that should actually change the lights, but okay. Let's see if we can get the lights changing. So okay, so we've got pink. Yep. Let's just cycle through the lights. It looks really cool. I've got the lights up at the moment in the bedroom. So awesome.